All right, Tracy, well, it was an emotional ending to a trial that's lasted five days and had some setbacks along the way, including today. But the jury decided not guilty for council member Kenyatta Johnson, his wife, Don Chavu, and the two other defendants who were part of a nonprofit that was accused of bribing the council member. Now, the council member's wife broke down in tears as the verdict was read. And this essentially puts an end to a case that has lasted two trials. If you'll remember, back in February, there was a mistrial in this very case. Jury couldn't come to a decision. Um, but the council member was accused of accepting $67,000 in bribes through a contract that the prosecution alleged was a sham contract, wasn't real, yet the jury today saying that was not it. They said um, they declared it was not guilty. And this is the second city council member to go on trial for bribery in less than a year. A different and, of course, more positive outcome for council member Johnson and his wife and two other defendants. Now, we tried speaking with the council member outside. He gave a brief statement but didn't really answer any questions. Um, here's some of what he had to say. Um, I want to most importantly thank all of my um, supporters and my yes, constituents right for their prayers and their emails and their showing up to court and believing in us. And a spokesperson for the council member said he will be in council chambers tomorrow for the regularly scheduled meeting. As for the prosecution, they didn't want to comment as they left, but a spokesperson for them told us that they'll be back in court tomorrow for the second part of the case of the trial that involves the other two defendants, not the council member. In Center City, Claudia Vargas, NBC10 News. Claudia, thanks.